the glam pop band Shakespeare's Sister. Siobhan and Marcy, uh, could you tell me how your uh, musical influences differ from one another? Well, I think it can be encapsulated perfectly in our favourite female singers. <laughs> Marcy's is Aretha Franklin, as she said, and mine's Patti Smith. So they're sort of extreme opposites. Where we meet is that we share commonality in mm. the um, Motown thing, and then I also love T Rex and David Bowie. Uh -huh. and, and Sly Stone. And Sly, yeah, we're both I love big Sly. Fans of Sly. Right. Yeah, huge, yeah. What did you? What, what attracted you to to popular music? I mean, the way people looked, or or the way they sound, or. Uh, the amazing thing about pop music is that it's um, a combination of both. I mean, um, there, are, there are other kinds of music that are um, equally emotive or more emotive, really, mm -hmm. but um, the whole thing about pop music is expressing a persona, a personality, and, and, and the visual side of that is, is uh, a vital way of doing it. Yeah. So I've always been totally fascinated by um, people who really play with imagery. I think for me, um, looks were always a secondary thing. I always was if I'm moved by the music. I mean, it always helps if you know something looks interesting, but if it doesn't, it kind of makes it interesting too. Um, you know, in a funky kind of way. What did you like about Mark Bolan, most well, of all? Um, he was absolutely gorgeous. Mm. Right. <laughs> With the sparkly stuff on his face and the feather boa, it was amazing. I mean, he was a real sort of female man. It's funny. Um, I think. Most of my favourite artists have always played with gender. And uh, the song Hot Love, why, what attracted you to that? We both love Bolan, we both love Tina. Yeah, we wanted something that, um, to perform at the end of the set where everyone could just let their hair down and, mm. you know, that's, ha have a bit of a party. And uh, it goes down a storm every night. Mm. It sends them home singing it, you know. <laughs>
Yeah. The right time. <laughs>